All right, it's time to have one of our little chit chats. Um, I want to talk about clothes and minimalism and rewearing the same clothes. Because I noticed on a family vlog, somebody commented that the mother only gave her children four pairs of clothes and how her kids must be like so made fun of for wearing the same clothes again and again and that she felt so bad for them and of course this may have been taken a little bit too extreme on the commenter's behalf because uh, these children are very well clothed with nice quality clothes and yeah they don't have a ton of clothes um, but they don't they're not like suffering and I wanted to talk about wearing the same clothes because I am wearing the same leggings that I wore yesterday and you can see it in my vlog from yesterday so Here's the thing, when I was probably in fourth grade, you know, probably even when I was little, all the way until um, about last year, I had too many clothes. Like, my closet was full, there was no way to organize, I kept trying to organize, I was like, I just need a bigger closet, that's the solution. When in fact, I really just needed less clothes. And there's this thing about, well, do you wear the same clothes too often? And there's a friend of mine that I remember in middle school she'd wear a lot of the same t-shirts and I'd notice those t-shirts Now I wouldn't be like you're wearing the same clothes what are you doing it was like oh is that t-shirt and this t-shirt and I like this t-shirt but here's the thing I had too many clothes before and I didn't wear probably 60% of them when I did laundry it was a pain in the butt to go put those clothes back in the closet because there was no room and I felt bad giving away clothes because it was like, I know my mom bought this for me and I never wear it. And now, once I've decluttered, which by the way, I have a decluttering video, Foolproof Method to Decluttering, or you can go look on my website, my blog, there is um, that on there as well if you need it in the written form. But decluttering is probably one of the best minimalism choices I've made in far as clothes. Now. As for college, I have a capsule wardrobe, which means I probably have by now like 40 to 50, I don't think it's 50, if you include everything, maybe it's 50, clothes that I have at college. And that's every single article, including jackets, necklaces, jewelry, um, shoes. So actually, having less clothes makes it a lot easier for me. And yeah, I'm wearing the same pair of leggings that I wore yesterday, but these leggings are so soft, they are such nice quality, and I'm comfortable, and they're stylish, and I like it. I like wearing these clothes, and I wear these clothes more often, and they're nicer quality, and I appreciate them a lot more, and I feel better wearing them, rather than just pulling something and be like, oh, I guess I'll wear this, or I haven't worn this in a while, I guess I can wear that, because I used to have clothes that I hated, or I just didn't like, and now all the clothes fit me well, they're comfortable, they look good, and I enjoy them. And so I think that's just my thought on it. And I actually think one of the things that you can do to hurt yourself the most is having too many clothes and too many choices. Because once we have too many choices, it is hard to make decisions. It clutters our mind, it clutters our life, it causes stress. And I really like that I can wear this pair of leggings that, by the way, again, are super soft and not worry about it. And yeah, I'm not wearing the exact same clothing, but even how I was, so what? It doesn't really matter. It just doesn't really matter. That's my take on that. Anyways, back to the vlog. much later in the day this evening you can see the sunset over on um, this side of the building outside my window and I am making hot water for tea brewing right here and I have my mug right here and I need to pick out a tea so 
do that. Um, I kind of feel like some peppermint. This is my outfit that I had today. I have my hair, uh, which is doing a wonderful wavy thing today, and I have some of the sides pinned up a little bit. I have this green scarf, which I don't know where I got. I think JCPenney. And then I have this shirt from TJ Maxx or Marshalls. And again, these leggings from TJ Maxx or Marshalls. I keep saying TJ Maxx or Marshalls because quite frankly, um, I bought all these clothes on the same day and I can't remember which is which. I know which store is which, but I don't know which stuff came from which place because they have a lot of the same things. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and let the rats out and drink my tea. I also have to read the Bible and my devotional and record that. And I guess we're doing an evening vlog. in this devotional how it says that um, having an awareness for God will only increase our ability to give love and encouragement to others because I feel like that can be lacking at times not knowing how to uplift others or even how to interact with them or provide advice or understand what to do but if you turn to God and trust in God his light and his knowledge will go through you to help others and that's really significant that he gives us that <laughs> I'm going to end the vlog here. I hope you enjoyed watching and I hope you had a good day or night or whatever it is there. And I'll see you next one. Bye. Guess where the ratties are. There's one right here and there's one right here.